Hello everybody! Today I am going to show you a little Too Faced Sugar Pop tutorial uh, just using this palette and this palette alone. Um, just showing you the colors right here and then I'm going to go ahead and use the Too Faced Shadow Insurance just because it made sense. I was using a Too Faced palette, why not? <laughs> and I just apply this with a Q-tip. So now I'm going to use Peach Fuzz and put that all in or on the inner corner of my eyelid. Um, I kind of take it out to about the outer or middle half. And now I'm going to take bubble gum. And I'm just using my Elizabeth Mott uh, all over shader brush. And I'm just going to take this in the middle part of my eyelid and out to the corner, the outer corner, but it's not too imperative that you do that part. Uh, you just kind of want to get it nice and blended out. Now I'm going to use Blackberry and I'm going to use my Too Faced crease blender brush it's something like that uh, and just blend this into my outer corner and this takes me a really 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 long time it's like just tons of blending blend 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 and this is when you're thankful that I sp was speeding it up or else we'd be here like all day waiting for me to blend this out like seriously <laughs> this just kind of keeps it as an everyday kind of look. Oh, and here I am taking more of that peach fuzz and I'm just kind of blending everything out. So now I am taking Sugared Violet and I'm taking my uh, smudger brush by Too Faced and I'm just going to smudge this into my upper and lower lash line. This is when I feel like it really just plays on the colors and we're in incorporating those colors from the palette, the fun colors but it's still very wearable. It's not it's not in your face color. So like I said, I put a little bit of that sugar violet at the bottom and then I am also going to take more of the bubble gum and put that below the sugar violet uh, on my lower lash. And here I'm going to take, I believe it's rock candy and put that all over uh, my upper or my lower brow bone area. And then I'm all done the eyeshadow. So now I'm going to move on to mascara. I'm just using my Revlon mascara curling wand thing, whatever. And then I'm going to use my Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara. I like to do two coats top and bottom. And for some weird reason, this takes me forever to do also. So again, be glad I'm fast forwarding it because we would be here all day. I mean, I'm still not even done my first coat yet. This takes me forever. I swear, if this didn't take so long, I could get ready like, I don't know, 10 minutes faster in the morning. <laughs> but they just never go where I want them to go. So I spend so much time making sure that they are in the right place, which is difficult. But I do eventually get there. <laughs> so now I'm going to use my Rimmel Mascara. I really like this brush or the wand I should say it has these tiny little teeth and it just really makes it easy to get in there so now I'm going to use a q-tip and just clean up anything that I might have messed up uh, I normally just mascara where I've touched the wand to my face or to my lid so yeah just cleaning that up because I always seem to get stuff on my eyelids or my eyes um, and it's just easier to clean it up once it's dry. So this is the completed look. I really think this is just a fun way to play with these colors and still be able to wear it to work or even to school, but it's still nice enough that you could wear it out on a nice evening. Uh, that is everything that I have for you guys today. Uh, thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also follow me on Instagram at HairByLizzyBug. I hope you guys have a wonderful week, and until next time, bye!